let's look at the weighted methods in the previous videos we managed to look at the unweighted methods and that is simple aggregate and simple relative method so the weighted methods these ones have scholars the three scholars we have the spells then pache and then fisher so the three scholars and for the weighted methods we have the price index and then the weighted index so in case of the price index for this scholar called plus payer the price index we do summation q naught p1 out of summation q naught p naught times 100 whereby q naught is quantity for the base year p1 is prices for the current year and p naught is prices for the base year and this is the spells price index it's the formula we use to calculate for price index yeah in case we use the spells method times 100 yeah, but the main thing that we have to note is that him he he concentrates more on the on the base year than the current year so in his price index we are using more of the base year and then another thing is that when we are calculating for price index quantity is constant it is only prices that are changing here we have p naught and then p1 but quantity is constant q naught q naught so he he uses the base year as the constant q naught q naught but then the prices are changing because it is price index we have p naught and then p1 then for the weighted index weighted index we have it is summation q1 p naught out of summation q naught p naught times 100 we say las Perales concentrates more on the base here so here since we are calculating for weighted index weighted it's about quantity so here quantity is changing but price is constant in the price index quantity is constant but price is changing so here quantity is changing from q0 to, to, to q1 and prices are constant p0 p0 and that is the weighted index according to the, the according to the spares then for the next color is called pache him his price index it is summation q1 p1 out of summation q1 p0 him he concentrates more on the current year so for the price index for the price index prices are changing from q from p p0 to p1 but quantities are constant q1 q1 so him he makes the quantity of the current year constant and this one makes the quantity of the base year constant it is the difference between the formulas this is q1 q1 this is q0 q0 yeah then p0 p0 because it is price index the prices have to change then times 100 then in case of the weighted index weighted index see since it is about weight it is about quantity here quantity changes from q0 to q1 but the prices this constant like from q1 to q1 p1 p1 he does not change because we are dealing with weighted index not price index but for price index quantity is constant and prices are changing for weighted index For weighted index quantity is changing but prices are constant yeah so the difference between this scholar and this scholar is that for this he for, for this one he concentrates more on the base year this one concentrates more on the current year so here the difference between the formulas is this is p naught and p naught and this is p1 and p1 yeah times 100 so once you master that you're good to go then the last scholar is called Fisher. Fisher. Yeah, the last scholar is called Fisher. 
if I pronounce it in any way doesn't matter. Yeah, so here you just combine the two formulas of plus pairs and then purchase to get Fisher's method for price index. So you get this summation q0 p1 out of summation q0 p0 put it here summation q0 p1 like that then times this one's formula the way it is here you put it here q1 p1 q1 p0 times 100 you get fisher's price index then for the the weighted index you get this the the, the weighted index for las pairs and weighted index for pache you multiply you get for fisher so it is this, put it here, times this, put it here, then times a hundred. So these are the main two scholars. Uh, if you if you know their formulas, you can easily get for this one. Yeah, and this is and these are the weighted methods. We are going to look at an example in the next video.